Is anybody surprised that an anti-war candidate in Russia has been banned from challenging uh, Putin in the election? Like, yeah, Putin is going to do everything to pre prevent anybody that is against the war in Ukraine from challenging him. Nor is he actually going to let anybody become president but him. He's going to kill off anybody who uh, runs against him. Now, in Russia, a former TV journalist has been barred from challenging President Putin in the country's upcoming presidential elections. Our reporter, Naomi Choi Smith, is in the newsroom and has more. Well, it was a short lived presidential bid for former TV journalist turned politician Yekaterina Dunsova, who threw her hat in the ring just three days ago. She's one of 29 contenders who have filed to run for president in Russia so far. The candidates are then expected to gather thousands of signatures from supporters before they qualify to have their name on the ballot. Now Dunsova will no longer get that chance after the Russian Electoral Commission banned her from running, saying she had, quote, mistakes on her application and telling Dunsova on Saturday. You would think that if she just had mistakes on the application, she could just submit a new application and they can tell her what the mistakes were besides just outright her from being able to run today quote you are a young woman and you have everything ahead of you now Dunsova yeah so they're, they're probably just basically saying since you're a young woman it's best for you to just uh, stay at home and be a mom and probably threatening to threatening her so that she doesn't want to run had planned to run on a campaign of ending the war in Ukraine and freeing Russian political prisoners those include Kremlin critic who is serving consecutive prison sentences, Alexei Navalny. Well, when asked about concerns for her own security and fears for her safety in running for president, Dunsova did admit she did have some fears and concerns, saying, quote, any sane person taking the step would be afraid, but fear must not win. Yeah, because uh, she's probably going to either be poisoned by Putin or have her plane shot down or something's going to happen. She also said that she believed Russians were looking for an alternative to President Putin at the ballot box. Take a listen. Many people write to me, you gave us hope. If you manage to get registered, we will definitely vote for you. They do not see any alternative and also consider boycotting the elections. Well, Dunsova's disqualification leaves no notable opposition candidate to challenge Putin in the presidential elections in March. Oh, surprise, surprise. Now there's nobody to challenge Putin. Well, President Putin, for his part, is seeking a sixth term in office. He's been in power either as president or prime minister since 1999. And the upcoming elections will mark the first presidential ballot since Russia launched its war in Ukraine nearly two years ago.